What's up, worlds? The Seven Worlds Gaming here today, and today I'm showing you my first Lamborghini that I got, and for some reason, yes, this is a Lamborghini that I never heard about, but it's a 1988 Lamborghini Jalpa. As you can see it right there, it's still a thing of beauty, man. This was actually like the younger brother of the Lamborghini Countach. So if you weren't able to afford a Countach, this was the next best thing. This car went anywhere around, I believe I, I read somewhere where it was 35,000 upwards of 60,000 anywhere between that range right now the cars actually sell if you if you like to collect Lamborghinis this cars actually go ahead and sell anywhere from 65,000 up to 110,000 dude and the 0 to 60 on this cars was actually about wait for it 5.8 seconds dude <laughs> so I figured why not let's go ahead and just make a video because this is my first car First Lamborghini that I got so far, okay? And I actually went ahead and got it while leveling up. It was one of the options. I was like, why not? Let's go ahead and make this bad boy our first Lamborghini in Forza Motorsport 7. <laughs> if you have not that seen that video on how to make millions in Forza 7, go ahead and check it out. I'll leave it in the link in the description. If not, just go ahead and check out the Forza 7 Motorsport. We are going to be racing this car. But before we race this car, I want to go ahead and give a huge shout out to the comment of the day, which is actually going to go ahead and go to... No Limits TV, by the way, love ya, pineapples, appreciate it bro, appreciate it, by the way, thank you so much, I think that was your, that was the first comment of the video, so thank you so much for the support, if you guys want to be featured in comment of the day, make sure to not leave without leaving a comment below, now without further ado, let's actually go ahead and drive this car, yo DJ, do me a favor, turn up the music because we are just gonna go ahead and hear this car for the first time in this channel, maybe, I don't even know if there's a video about this car, <laughs> So it might be the first time ever on YouTube, at least on Forces 7. So let's go ahead and see what this car's got to offer. By the way, let's see where we're going to go ahead and race. Uh, let me go ahead and set up our race real quick here. Let's go ahead and race in Austin. I found out that this game has Austin as one of the freaking cities that you can race on. Which, if you didn't know, I actually live in Austin, Texas. And I'm very familiar with this track because i usually go there to watch like formula one and the moto gp events and it's freaking insane dude like it's really awesome especially formula one formula one is on another level obviously <laughs> well, let me go ahead and see okay i think we're done there selected the car we should be good did it not save oh my gosh i just did all of that and it didn't save yep i'm a noob i'm still a noob at this game okay don't <laughs> don't hate me for it here we go by the way, yes, I'm currently using a PC. I'm pretty sure you guys can hear the clicking. I am, however, going to be using my steering wheel. So we'll go ahead and get started once that's done. All right. I think that's good now. There you go. I did it right this time. Thank you. Thank you, game. Thanks for not making me look like a dummy here. <laughs> this car actually looks pretty cool, man. Let me see. Let me go ahead and give you some other facts here. By the way, I wrote them on this side of the screen. Just because I have never heard about this Lamborghini ever. Like ever oh look at that that's my that's actually like one of the backgrounds on my phone i took a picture just like that said the formula one cars were just turning it was pretty freaking cool all right wish me luck hopefully we don't just completely suck on this i'm still trying to still get used to the freaking damn i said still twice like within five seconds okay <laughs> i'm definitely trying to get used to this through will because i just can't can't seem to get the hang of it so here we go worlds here we go! Oh, what? It's putting me up against those cars? That's not fair. I'm definitely gonna lose. Or not? Yo. Yeah. No way. Oh my gosh, dude. I forgot that the Austin course is just ridiculous. That that corner right there. I remember seeing my first MotoGP event ever. And dude, it was just... The first corner, people crashed, people were sliding up. It was pretty awesome, actually. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. It was like, I was hoping somebody would crash. I was just not expecting it for it to happen on the first. Oh my gosh, we're actually not doing bad here. I think my practice might have worked out a little bit. Oh, as I jinxed it and I almost went off the, off the track. Come on, move. Don't hurt my car, but what was I saying? Oh yeah, the MotoGP. I was not expecting for people to actually crash on the first corner, dude. It was awesome. It was awesome. Plus, everybody drinks beers. Let's just say people were getting lit. And it is Texas. 
So we wanted to definitely see some crashes. I usually watch NASCAR here and there, so I guess I mean I used to watch uh, Formula One at a very young age, especially because of uh, Juan Pablo Montoya, a Colombian driver. He used to have this epic. Whatever him and Michael Schumacher, which hopefully I think he's still in a coma. It sucks, dude. But hopefully he gets better soon. But him and Juan Pablo Montoya used to get in some insane battles, dude. I'm talking about like it was awesome. You know, like Juan Pablo was not very respectful of Michael Schumacher, and they would just crash constantly, like tap each other, not literally crash, like race like how I'm currently racing that car, okay? Just think of Michael Schumacher and his Juan Pablo Montoya, because I'm currently winning. <laughs> Schumacher would would win most of them. Yo, this car is actually like we're not doing bad. Let me go ahead and check out the inside. Oh no, I pressed the wrong button again, dude. I keep doing that. I keep thinking I'm on. For some reason, I keep thinking I'm on Xbox, so I keep pressing the the completely wrong button here. Oh, all right. I don't know if this is gonna help or if it's gonna make it worse. This is usually where I sit, like, I usually go general admission when I go to watch the races because it's so cheap, it's like a hundred bucks to watch the race, and you get to experience something really cool, and I think usually like kids get to go there for free, so if you've never been to Austin, I will highly suggest it, oh bro, yo we're doing good, oh my gosh, what, did my sons do something to the steering wheel, I'm surprised at how good we're doing right now. It is going to be two laps. Is that my fastest lap ever? Oh gosh, come on, come on, come on. Like, you can't even see anything. Oh, that was nice. Yo, we might be getting the hang of this steering wheel. Are you kidding me? What do you, let me know in the comments below. What do you worlds think about this car? Have you ever heard about this Lamborghini Jalpa? 1988, by the way. Just want to make sure I confirm that. And it was like... Think of this car like the version of the Lamborghini Gallardo, I think it is. Yeah, I think, yeah, the Lamborghini Gallardo, meaning like it's one of the cheaper options. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Dude, if we get first place right now, I don't even know what my difficulty is set at, but so far we have not luckily had to rewind at all with the steering wheel. Amazing. But yeah, this is like. At the time, this was a cheaper version. So if you couldn't afford the Lamborghini Countach, which I'm probably saying the name wrong, this was the next best thing. This was like its little brother. It's cute. It's. I wish I could look around. I'm pretty sure there might be a way to look around. I'm not even gonna try. Did I accidentally just? Oh, that's a break. Never mind. I forgot. I, I on this steering wheel, guys. I had to switch some of this stuff. I had to make my clutch on the pedals, I had to make my clutch the freaking brake because the brake is so like, it's insane in this, in this kit. And the shifter, since I really don't use the shifters, I have it mostly in automatic. I currently have one as a handbrake because I'm trying to get used to everything. This is completely new to me and I'm surprised we're doing this great. Spoke too soon! We're gonna keep it going though, we're gonna keep it going. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's gonna be a close finish. It is gonna be a close finish here. Come on, baby. And as you can tell, I, I actually went ahead and turned on the the brake line. That way I kind of know because at the beginning we were trying to do it. I think I was trying to make it too difficult for myself. So I had to like ease into it. Especially with the steering wheel and everything. Hopefully you worlds are enjoying this video. If you want to go ahead and see more Forza 7, Make sure to not leave that leaving a like. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. And I think we are about to get this win with this beast, dude. Woo. A little bit scratched up, okay? It happens. It happens. 1988 Lamborghini Joppa. Who would have thought it could be some of the cars we just beat? Celine S7? Yeah, that's uh, that's not supposed to be possible, but it is a video game, so it's whatever. <laughs> I'm cool with it. Let me go ahead and see how much money I got from here. Come on. Show me a good amount of money. First place, baby. First place. Yo, actually, DJ, turn on the music again, please. Just, there you go. Thanks, DJ.
All right, let's see. Show me the money. Show me the money. By the way, my, my suit looks so cool. I don't think I'm ever going to change that suit. Ooh, nice. That's actually not bad, though. Oh, and we got to level up. Hell yeah. Ooh, what should we get here? 450 for a BMW? 507 or 50,000 credits? I'm going to go with a BMW. Why not, right? I got some money to spend. Let's just go ahead and do it. There you have it, world. That's going to be the end of this video right here. This has been the Lamborghini... What? No, hold on a second. This has been the 1988 Lamborghini Jalfa. Hopefully you enjoy it. If you did, once again, make sure to not leave without leaving likes. Make sure you follow me on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and also my live stream channel because I will start doing some more live streams with this steering wheel. And I'm really trying to find like a really cool way to record the steering wheel because I did a live stream and I think you guys really enjoyed it. So I'm going to see if maybe I can improve on that view of the steering wheel and how I race when I'm actually using this thing. As always, world, it has been the 7 Worlds Gaming, and I will see you in the next one. This was actually not bad. I'm surprised with this car. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Bye-bye, everybody.